Yo, Jay Bleasy coming at you. So Lane Kiffin hired who today? I'm just kidding, guys. You know, I actually don't know a whole lot about these coaches, Durkin, uh, Partridge, Finley. Um, you know, I know about the past, about Durkin and the incident at Maryland. I think we all know about that. Do we know the facts? Was it his fault? I, I don't know. I'm not going to get into it because, um, like I said, I don't know a lot about him. But I, what I do know is I like the fact that Lane Kiffin has taken his time in handpicking his own guys. You know, no need to rush. I think these are the guys that he really wanted. You know, uh, props to Mike McIntyre. He did a great job when he was here. He'll, he'll be fine. But um, there's going to be a lot of chatter nationwide about Lane Kiffin hiring DJ Durkin as a defense coordinator because that's what he's going to be. Um, but, guys, let's forget about it. We're on the Lane train. The Lane train is rolling. He's handpicking his guys. Let's rock and roll. I like Finley because he's going to add that tight end dimension. That's his background. We underused Cooley and Knox big time in the past. All the Rebel fans know that. I would have loved to have seen Cooley get a lot more touches. But let's just keep rocking and rolling on the lane train. These guys are supposed to be really good recruiters. And so let's finish strong. That's what we need. And um, I heard Lane Kiffin said there's still a lot of great recruits out there. That's quote, unquote, great recruits is what he said. So let's see you go get them, Lane. Good luck with your staff. You know, we're behind you 100%. Rebel fans don't mind the chatter out there because they're always going to be chatting. But let's get a pop and Jay Bleasy coming at you once again. Please subscribe to my channel, Jay Bleasy 38. Peace.